All right, 48 teams, hundreds of kids all getting the chance to live their dreams on one of the world's most famous rinks. This is a great <laughs> program. These little athletes are becoming junior Rangers for the first annual Junior Rangers Cup. And the best of the best will have the opportunity to play like a pro on the ice where the pros play. Get it? Here to tell us more about it are some pros themselves. Look at these guys. They're pros. <laughs> Ranger greats Adam Graves and Brian Mullen. Thanks for joining us. First off, before we begin. Mm -hmm. You've been helping kids for a long time, the organization. You're just taking this to a whole new level, right? Yeah, this is the first year for the Junior Ranger Cup. And now, like Cindy said, we have 48 teams competing. 12 will make it to the Garden, play for the championship. But uh, overall, we have like 130,000 kids that wow. went through all our programs. That's what I was looking at, those stats. Yeah. That's just amazing, uh, great outreach, but it's also life lessons for these kids, right? Again, it's uh, in hockey, and the great teacher of any uh, sport where you have teammates is just how to work with other people well, and you know, people's skills. That's the key. It's funny because whenever we, I mean, all athletes are wonderful, but I, hockey is known for the kindest athletes, I have to say. So I'm, I'm guessing that that's something Greatest you teach these kids. And kind of, wait, 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 wait. I have no, to clarify. I have to clarify that it is a much softer and more skilled game, and I, and I like it. And, and certainly at that level, the rules are such that uh, the kids are, are protected. Uh, the equipment is unbelievable. There's no hits, hits to the head. It's all about skill and fun and having fun in an environment where the kids aren't worried about getting hurt. And these kids are young, eight years old and under. Yes. For this cup, yeah. okay. And boys and girls, yeah. equal opportunity. It's 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 absolutely fantastic. And and for these kids to get the opportunity to play on Madison Square Garden, nice. You talk to any entertainers that say, "Hey, I got to the garden." The garden. How about, mm -hmm. how about yeah. kids? You know, uh, that are eight years old, their siblings, or moms and dads. This is a weekend that capsule will never forget. I, you know, I was going over this, the the tournament rules. I mean, you're not messing around. I mean, everything is just like the pros, right? Oh yeah, yeah. You know, I'm a New Yorker. I grew up in this neighborhood right here, and uh, I got to skate on the garden ice and uh, these kids uh, they're going to want to skate on that garden ice so uh, it's going to be a tough tournament to, to get there. What kind of reaction do you get? I'm, I'm sure you've met some of the kids at some point and when they meet you and they... You know what? Um, I think we get more of a reaction from the parents. <laughs> <laughs> the kids say, oh yeah, they're two old hockey players. Right, right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it, the parents actually seen us play, so we get more, more of a reaction from the parents. I just have to ask, though. We're talking about little kids. Mm -hmm. I'm looking at the garden. That is a lot of real estate. This is really hard for the kids, too, right? I mean, is it regulation? And again, no, we're, we're splitting the, the uh, arena say. into two, mm -hmm. two, two halves. It's, yeah. it's smaller, yeah. and, and it's, uh, it's after the uh, USA hockey model. Okay. And we think skill development in smaller areas because it forced the kids to have their head up yeah. and develop the skills. And, and throughout our entire program, that's what we're emphasizing in smaller station work. And you see the improvement for us. It's, it's all about confidence, too, and athleticism. Mm -hmm. And these kids, they start, and some of these kids, they can't even skate at our, our try hockey for free. 12 weeks later, they're skating around, handling the puck, their head is up and their confidence both on and off the ice just goes through the roof. And it's so great. Right now, they are competing in four different places in the area. Yeah, they're up in Brewster, Connecticut, uh, Long Island, and uh, Somerset, New Jersey. So is it too late or are all the teams set? What's the uh, status? It, it's all set. We have uh, three divisions in each uh, site and then there'll be uh, uh, four teams in each division. So uh, essentially uh, uh, 12 teams in total will be coming from those four sites, three from each site. And tomorrow at the Garden after the uh, uh, Flyers uh, Rangers game, mm -hmm. hopefully a Rangers win, yeah. uh, we'll get out uh, on the ice and then we'll see the real hockey start when, uh, when the kids great. are out there. That's, That's great. great. Thank you so much for being here. It's such an honor to meet both of you. Thanks for having us. Thanks for having us. Love it. Well, of course, we have more information about first annual Junior Ranger Cup and the teams participating on our website. Website, just skate over there, cbsnewyork.com.